there, little buddy? What are you doing there? You scuts got lucky. We almost murdered out. The word is murdered. That's what he said. Sheesh, no use being pediatric. <sighs> oh, crap. Would kill a lot of you. Not you, Mr. Big Words. Nope. Lady H won't be you alive. Not too alive. Well, then you have failed your mission miserably. Peter Quill, these lackluster bounty hunters claim Lady Hellbender hired them to kill us. Hey, we're no slouches. We're part of a league now. No, no, no. Not a league. You said yourself she'd hunt us to the end of the universe. I had hoped she'd send a monster. Not these two. We would have murderized you. But don't worry. There's more coming. Uh, did you hear that, Peter Quill? A silver lining. Yeah, that's great, Drax. Won't be long in these clabber traps. Not us. Mm -mm. Friends will be breaking us out soon. Huh? Hey, this Real is a big mistake. I'm innocent. Let me wish we did, kid. Cosmo, are you out there? Cosmo! Hello? Cosmo? I really need to use the bathroom. Nice that you finally showed up. Would have been even nicer if you didn't abandon me in the first place. I never left. One minute, we're having a great time, and the next... Wait a second, did you use me as bait? Huh. Yeah, get your mitts off of him. Ow! A little butter just scratched me. Oh, I'll do more than that. I'll murderize you. Uh. <laughs> hey, guys. Didn't expect to see you here. Yeah, cram it, Flatnard. Flatnard? Yeah, and a scruff crew in one, too. Shut up and get in there. Come on, dude. What's your problem? You are. That's why we quit. Yes, you did. Now stop talking to him. Rocket, buddy, come on. We had a good thing going. You and Groot are better than two-bit bounty hunters. Scoff. What did you say? I said scoff. You don't say scoff, you just scoff. Oh, so now I don't express myself proper like? <sighs> you know what? You're a real piece of... <laughs> What do you think I was gonna say? Rocky, dude, woof! We should have buffed you in when we buffed the chance. <laughs> like we are. You don't woof woof woof! What? You rough in front of me? I told you a bajillion times, I'm not a rough animal! What were you talking about? You woof! <laughs> <laughs> This. Where are we? You ought to have been still on nowhere. <laughs> Osmo! How you doing, buddy? We were just about... <laughs> Guardian of Galaxies will tell Cosmo why they broke into Continuum Cortex. Or Cosmo will conjure worse psychic Gulag. Broke into the... the... Do not feed Cosmo Cat Biscuit's Peter Quill. You work with Blood Brothers. Create distraction so pesky raccoon and sentient tree friend can use Continuum Cortex. Cosmo also know Guardian of Galaxies have Nova Tracker on ship. Okay, I'm sure it's just one big misunderstanding. Right? Right. We're here because something happened on the... No Guardian of Galaxy, we're on Nova Rock. Yeah, we went to find Centurion Corral and pay our fine. Why? Strange transmissions spreading across galaxy. Like rabbits in springtime. Cosmo sent many team to investigate, none return. Now Nova Rock sending same signal. Guardian of Galaxy will tell me what they saw. The Nova Corps were killing each other. It was like they were drinking funky juice or something. Or joined the cult. Yeah, during that ritual with the priest. 
They kept talking about a promise. <laughs> right away, sir. Fraternity of Raptors. Cult of the Negative Zone. Universal Church. Whoa, 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 stop. <laughs> that's them. That old man that's with them. His shuttle exploded on the Hallow's Hope. Grand Unifier Raker. Leader of the Universal Church of Truths. That name ring bell for Cosmo. His old cult. Very powerful during Galactic War. Now, not so much. You said the rock was transmitting a signal. What if the religion were somehow... And yet, the Universal Church of Truths died with gold skin God. Let us investigate the Hallow's Hope for you. <laughs> what? You said none of your teams return, right? Seems to me like you're short-staffed, and we want to find out what happened as much as you do. We do? So let us investigate for you. Always a catch, Peter Quill. And not fun kind with Paul. What Guardian of Galaxies want in return? Simple. Drop the charges. Contact Nova Corps HQ and get the world mind to forgive our fine. Then we'll go. It's not being so easy. Face it, dog breath. You need us. Us? For now. Unless you got someone else stupid enough to go. In Soviet Russia, Cosmo would not trust words of capitalist scum. But this is not motherland. And Cosmo no power of collateral. Guardian ship, still nowhere. What? You can't take our ship. My ship. How are we gonna find the Hallow's Hope? Ask Pesky Raccoon. Now come, essences of time. So where are we going exactly? To original settlement. From early days, before Tiva group come. You mean the first mining colony is still here? Duh. Now abandoned. Mostly. Entirely restored. This is the place you broke into. Broke implies it took effort. Wait, this is the Continuum Cortex? It's, it's the best, best way, way to reach Nova, Nova ship before it moves again. You found Corel. Where is she? Nova ship currently in the leader system, orbiting Michael. Contraxia. Cosmo not surprised. Pesky Raccoon enjoy garbage planet. Their restrooms do provide valuable information. Entire planet now broadcasts same signal as Novorok. Cosmo not understand purpose or intention. All them bars, betting parlors, and brothels. Maybe it's not such a bad thing after all. Cosmo bent to agree with Assassin. We can find Corel and save Contraxia. Maybe we shouldn't make too many guarantees. We're the guardians of the galaxy. This is what we do. I am with you, Peter Quill. You are? Of course. It was a rousing speech. Bootlicker. How many people know about this place? Enough. It's not broadcast across galaxy, but scientists come from many backgrounds. If Thanos had known this was here... Ah, dead Titan King no longer concerned for cause. I am... So, what is this, like another elevator? They'll figure it out. Please to stand back, Guardian of Galaxies. Oh, what magnificent witchcraft is this? <laughs> I know. It's like they've never seen a giant transdimensional hand before. Please, to step in ball. What if things go sideways? How do we get back? With passport. Can communicate with Cosmo, and if emergency, bring Guardian of Galaxies back. I boot. 
Better you take it than Captain Valor over here. This time, investigate Nova ship. Use passport to report findings. And you'll speak to the world mind? Get rid of that fine, right? Ghost won't do the best. Good luck, Guardian of Galaxies. Anyone see any seatbelts? You better not throw off this time. This is... Sorcery? I was going to say dizzying. I am broke. You get used to it. Are we in space? We're somewhere between space, between dimensions, between time, between realities even. What do you mean, between? We could theoretically go wherever and whenever with this thing. Even the places that don't exist, but uh, do. The view is incredible. What kind of name is Avengers? Is that sound normal? <laughs> normal? You ain't heard nothing yet. Oh, Pat Benatar and Joan Jett watch over us. Who are these gods you speak of? Goddesses. Uh, Drax? <laughs> I am not the one laughing. It's obviously an ill omen of our impending deaths. No matter where you hide. I will fight. Or it's an alternate reality. <laughs> I know that sound. I am proud of it. Definitely an alternate reality. <laughs> hey, no! It's Spider-Man! Wait, is that Earth? Mom? Come on, you're deep for the promise here. Come on in, Janie. Peter will be up in a second. Really? Janie? Okay. Next stop, Alice Hope. Probably Hulk. <gasps> Flark and Howard! Okay, here we go! Whoa! This cannot be the correct. You guys okay? Do we look okay? Well, hang in there. I'll try to restore gravity. Oh, great. We're gonna be stuck like this forever. Rocket, buddy, what am I looking for? Drax, tell Scut Lord most ships use external power conduits to generate pseudo-gravity in hyperbaric airlocks. The beast says to find a power conduit. Right, and what do those look like? Tell him any vestiges of power should show up on his visor. And to stop asking so many flocking questions and get us down from here. Something terrible happened here. What gave it away? The lack of gravity or the general destruction? Both are undeniable clues. I'm not seeing anything useful. Somebody tell him I ain't gonna do all this work for him. Okay, I've got two conduits here. Someone tell them to turn them on. Thanks, buddy. Nothing's happening. Gamora, tell him to check the power supply. It's empty. Then tell him to find a battery. Did you catch that? Yeah, yeah. Dog mentioned an odd transmission. I do not hear it. Could be on a higher frequency. One only mutts can hear. Uh, someone tell him what he's looking for. Peter Quill, you are supposed to be looking for something. A battery, so we can get the lousy gravity going. Might be just what we need. Okay, got us a battery. Took him long enough. Hey, I'm trying, man. And we're still floating around. Dog report item. Who the flark are you talking to? I am making mental notes of the investigation. 
Okay, I got the battery installed, Gamora, but nothing's happening. Seriously? Uh, fine, I'll tell them. Listen up, slug breath. Tell me what you see. Uh, there's a blue wire and two connections, yellow and red. And one big green thing. Don't touch the green thing! Not a great time to start yelling, dude! Okay, okay. First, plug the wire to either connection. All we need is a little jump start. To either one? It's not brain surgery, just pick one. I... Uh, here goes nothing! Oh, crap! was not restored. You had one job, Quill. I did exactly what! <sighs> Impressive, Peter Quill. I didn't know you could do that. Neither did I. Those firearms are becoming quite formidable. Second time they've transformed like that. Third. If that was the third time, when was the first? The day I was kidnapped. When my mom died. We should continue our investigation for the dog. We'll need to get this wreckage out of the way first. Should we call Cosmo? Let him know what we've found so far? What do you mean, a code word? Fine. Groot won't call the mud word. Could be useful if we get cornered by whatever's on the ship. How about Quill Kill? Not covert enough. Must be something said in everyday conversation. Ooh, oh! The code word is Ride the Stars. And we should hold off calling Cosmo until we figure out what's going on. We should also standardize our use of the term dog report item to distinguish information of interest to our investigation. Yep. Sure thing, buddy. Dog report item. Something caused Novacore to abandon their ship. Maybe they all just quit. Some people don't give up when things start going wrong. Was that a crack? No, it was a pointed criticism. I am Groot. Can we just focus on what happened here? I agree. The dog's investigation is our priority. And finding out what happened to Corral and Nikki. Peter's guns can do. If he'd let me look at him, I could tell you. Drax, gonna need your stomping powers here. Of course, if you believe you can lead to a clue. Big red chumps you tussled with. A couple of idiots called the Blood Brothers. Lady Hellbender sent them. Guess she's still sore then. The Monster Queen's rage is unending. If I had any units, I'd bet that mutt knew what we were getting into here. He did not require much convincing. Why does that keep happening? 
there, you all felt that, right? Yep. The same thing happened when I tried to restore the gravity. It ain't never his fault, is it, Groot? Dast. Looks just like what happened on the rock. Indeed. It was a desperate attempt at a last defensive position. Good bottleneck for it. Everything that happened seems to be connected to this ship. Maybe your girlfriend went crazy after seeing you. I doubt Peter Quill could inspire this level of mutiny. Okay, we need to get to Corell's office. Someone tell Quill. Come on, dude. Can't we just talk to each other? Fine. You do know your girlfriend probably didn't make it. Now you are just being spiteful. You this would come in handy. Where'd you get a Nova passkey? Nikki gave it to me to keep it away from her mom. You can sell that. It must be worth a couple thousand units. Do you know what Nova Corps does to people who steal from them? <laughs> Look around. How much you want to bet there aren't enough Nova left to execute us? What do you hope to find here, Peter Quill? Nikki had all kinds of secret passageways on the ship. Maybe she left a message or something. I, I guess. I mean, we actually had a lot in common. Kind of reminded me of me, you know? I do not know. Uh, it doesn't matter. I just want to make sure her and her mom are okay. <clears throat> so what's the deal with Quill and that kid anyway? The cadet. I don't know. I thought he tried to save her just to impress Corel. No way. Drax's rap sheet. He's got to see this. I wonder if they'll find anything. Like a way to turn the power back on. Or some kind of hint to what happened. Oh, no. Please don't. Do you know this maintenance worker, Peter Quill? No. You seem relieved. I am. What the flark are you two doing? Let's go already! Now we're exploring maintenance tunnels. It can't hurt, can it? Better we check than miss something. This place don't look too safe is all. Perhaps Lady Hellbender sent a worthy beast to devour us. Oh yeah? And how would she know we were here? It is said the Monster Queen has eyes across the galaxy. There you go. This work is worth more than your worth, Quill. Still nothing but emergency power. Dog report item. Power outage in several sections of the ship. What are we missing? Let's run through it all. We got arrested by your girlfriend. As did the Churchman Grand Unifier Raker, and then his ship exploded. So maybe that's where it started. Raker might have had something on his ship. A gas, maybe? Wish I knew the layout of this tub better. Then we could figure out where this started. You know where we are, Gamora? Not really. A Nova never really let me out of their sight. They have good reason not to trust you. This again? I was only stating that Nova's position of not trusting you was accurate. But the longer we bicker, the more we might miss. Very inspirational. Yeah, you got that off the placemat? All I'm saying is we're in this up to our necks, and we'll need to work together to get out of it. I should have used the upper. No wonder we've been stumbling around in the dark. Whoa! Look at you, you sexy beast! Ah, uh, flirting rocket. Is it supposed to be upside down? Uh, only if you wanted to channel all the ship's power up through the ceiling. It makes no sense to me. There must be a reason. A bad one. Try that console. 
Uh, we can use this to reinvert the core, or uh, uh, de invert the de 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 rocket. Uh, the console safety locked because the mounting arms are retracted. If we can pop them out of them side panels, we can flip the core. This time. Here it comes. For Peter Quill's mask to guide us with its mysterious power. Ain't nothing mysterious about it. I programmed the Dastin thing. Huh. Looks like the arms are stuck without any power. I bet we could jumpstart them. How? Gotta be a power cell somewhere. Well, stop flarking around. It ain't gonna work without the arms. There's gotta be more machinery up there. Gamora, give me a boost. Of course. Here should be good. All right. <sighs> Definitely something up here. Obviously. Hell yeah, it worked. You know, them guns would make better engineering tools than weapons. Nice try. Let's get the other one free. Gamora, let's get the second one done. Okay. That did it. Get back down here. Now let's see what we can... Oh, Scott. Yeah, it's more of them infected freaks. Man, I was hoping we'd find Nova Corps here, but not like this. Now we know who inverted the core, but why? away from the ceiling? We must find a way up there and discover why. For the dog report. Rock... Hey, what's that console telling you? That you should come do the...
Hunters. Okay. This whole thing's a lift. We can ride it all the way up there. I guess Nova grunts and grease monkeys don't get the cool flying suits. Typical. Nobody respects their engineers these days. If you want efficiency, you gotta... Whoa! Clark! Clarky clamps! They're shutting us down! More freaks approach! Clark has de-re-inverted the core again! We just have to re de re invert it back! After we take some heads! They're bringing out the big guns! Trust me! Those Nova Corps cannons will take your head off! Leon the Hurt! Prepare yourself! Starting to wonder if there's anybody left in Nova Corps who isn't crazy! Feels like the crazy is that number of dead people in the galaxy! Die, you beast! Freaky Novas ain't much of an improvement over the real ones! Stop. Bomber's really messing with my bow! I believe the electrical thaumaturge is a priority! Why some time, Drew? Who starts a gunfight near a reactor core? They don't seem to be bothered by it! I must hold on! Better than a cup of coffee! Right with you, big guy! Guys got upgrades, huh? Finally, they're speaking my language. If it weren't for that fancy pants Nova Corps, I swear. When possible, circumvent electrical hazards. Finally, we're sick of those dashed in mines. Heads up! Get I'm ready! Me. Find you me an opening! Clark they know how to keep up the pressure! Stay tight! Oh, crap! Thanks, Peter. That's why I'm here. I can't Nova Corps put raise on. This isn't Nova Corps! They can't it's hold it to stop! Hey, Quill! Oh, I think the big guy sees the stars! Perish! That bloody my guy's really starting to take me off! Incoming explosive! Don't stand! Strip definitely not the Nova Corps I was hoping to find here! At last! I was growing bored! Now, Gamora! I shall enjoy this! So we can More keep Nova's moving. Baseball. I will tear them from their sockets. Ain't gonna work, Musclehead. But this time we've got a control room to play with. Looks like I can remove the clamps from here. Good. We will not be stopped by clamps. Ah, sneaky dast bags. They scrambled the power circuit so I can't release them. I grow tired of these clamps. Gonna have to reroute the circuits one by one to reset the power grid. Here, I'll get the door for you. You should be able to see the grid with your visor. Okay, visor's up. Now what? You should see power grids along the walls around here. Find their powered up nodes. Looking for glowy power nodes. Right. When you find them, you need to electrify the junction switch in the direction you want the power to flow. Shoot them with electricity? Yeah. Big, glowing lines routing back towards the clamps in the middle. 
Groot, I think I have an idea. Use your roots to raise that platform with me on it. Kind of a Groot Root Boost thing. Neat trick. Groot loves being helpful. He's always helpful. Try to find a way around. Here's good. So any guesses on what they're doing with all that power? Perhaps they're recharging their personal devices. Their what? Their electronic tablets and assorted communication gadgetry. And do you think they would need power from the ship's core for that? I am no expert in Nova technology. Okay, I bet I can reroute the power to get myself back out of here. Solid plan. Did that do anything? Not yet. You'll have to reroute a couple of them. So, is there any chance of Quill getting back together with Lady Law? <laughs> Hell yeah! Who's smarter than Novacore? Might be gunning for your job soon. You want to trade? I'm happy to sit in the captain's seat. You frequently sit in the captain's seat. I did not just hear that. Well, I think you had it right the first time. This would go a lot faster if we all had the ability to scan. Yeah, you got any uh, priceless lattice hex ornadium crystals lying around? I'll gladly build you one. Or we only have the one. What do your goggles do? That's why it's fine. Doors open, and I got the power flowing through. Almost qualified to be a junior engineer. Thanks. Try this wall open? No, I just end up wrecking my blade. Drax, I need a hole here to reach the grid. Then you will have one.
You know, normally you're not supposed to travel through dimensions without a quarantine and a decompression on the other side. Should we be concerned? Just keep an eye out for the warning signs. Mental degradation, paranoia. The clamps are unclamped. Slick. Now get back in here before we leave you behind. Yeah, let's see how far you get without your button pusher. Now that we know the infected Nova are here, we can agree that whatever's going on upstairs is really bad, right? They were furious when we removed their power source. It must be important to their effort here. Can't wait to smash it. Whatever it is. All right, this is our floor. Okay, this has potential. Drax, hit that panel where all the wires connect. <laughs> Step aside. Come out to the coast. We'll get together, have a few laughs. What's that? Uh, nothing. No, that. They must have flipped the core back. Something's powering up again. Now we're stuck in the ventilation. Great job, Quill. Dude, I know you're peeved, and I'm sorry. Apology accepted. Really? That's it? In case you hadn't noticed, there's more important things happening right now than Quill saying he's sorry. Whoa! Flark and Scott! What are these crackling gaboons doing to Contraxia? What is this thing, Rocket? I don't know. It looks like it's siphoning something. Something to do with It's like they're stocking up on something! What the fuck? Well, would never have allowed this to happen to a ship! So, you think she escaped? I don't know! She could be holed up in her office! We're not leaving till we find out what happened! This is where the churchman's shuttle exploded. Yeah, well, it looks a little different now. Because of the giant machine, yes. But I assure you, Peter Quill, this is where you and the girl almost fell to your deaths. So what is it? I think they're using the ray to fill some kind of battery. <gasps> Standard galactic I.O. ports. Regalian glass mat separators. Cree cathodes. I understood some of those words. I ain't never seen nothing like it! Energy readings are all over the place, but I can't tell what kind of energy it is! Dog report item. Massive device siphoning energy from Contraxia. Don't forget the energy cubes! Dog report item. Energy stored in strange cubes. Groot! We need to check out that giant ray thing! Can you get us across? Dog report item! We gotta destroy this thing! We don't even know what it is! Plus, we'd probably end up taking out the entire ship! And us with it! Let's avoid the scary beam! Good advice! Guardian of Galaxies, Cosmo Jenkin. Investigation lead him to believe Halaho is key to Galaxy Mystery. What is that noise? We are compiling an extensive dog report. Atraxia isn't looking so good. They're killing it is what they're doing. Tell Cosmo what is happening. They've got this giant ray thing he pointed at the planet. It's collecting some kind of energy. Have Guardian found Centurion Corel? Not yet. Guardian? Uh-oh. What is... Uh-oh, Piotr Quinn. Something just came up. We'll call you back. Your experience fighting Centurions will be necessary here, woman. Right out! Too far gone to talk to! 
thinking we check her office. I even know how we can get there. You know a way out of the hangar? Yeah, Drax spotted it on our way in. We can use the hole Nikki and I fell into when Raker's shuttle exploded. You know, we never did talk about why you jumped after her, Peter. Huh, that ain't right. Rocket, can you see where that vent leads? We should be prepared in case the beast tries to destroy this machinery. Yeah, thanks. Keep in mind, it may not stay damp forever. We still need a way through. Dog report item. The rumbling continues. to remove one of the batteries. You sure it's safe for us to be around these batteries, Rocket? Nope. If the weirdos don't kill us, the radiation might. Who knows? Perhaps the nearby machinery can help. So any 
Any new ideas on what the oversized vacuum's actually doing to track you? A few. Perhaps the nearby machinery can help. Drax, I'm gonna need you to drag this over. I will assume you have a plan. Ah, I see what you are thinking, Peter Quill. We can use the crane to grab a battery. Uh, right. Just like I planned. Just like I thought. Impressive work, Peter Quill. Just hope it does not cause an explosion. Well, let's not stick around to find out. All right, come on, the tunnel's just past here. We got lucky no one else showed up. The Unifier has detected an intrusion. Spread out. It will be contained by, by her, her will. will. Move! There's too many of them. In the hole! Jump! Still don't get why you jumped after the kid back then. Top ten dumbest things I ever saw you do. You should have seen how worried he was. Hey, Star Pants was our ticket with the captain. I was worried his death would lead to more jail time. It was adorable. I hate you all. Okay, group. I think I know my way around. We just need to get into the tunnels on the other side there. It grumbles more incessantly than a Catathion without breakfast. Pretty sure this is right. Pretty sure? Everything was on fire last time. I couldn't make that happen. No, no. Rocket, no! Ain't that a piece of the Unifier's old ship? Unifier. Yeah, whatever. When we were arrested, they mentioned Raker got caught for the same thing we did. Not exactly the same. He got caught scavenging in the quarantine zone. Forget Raker. Our focus right now is finding Nikki. Your focus? My focus is not dying on this stupid ship. The dog wants us to find Centurion Corel. Right, so we're multitasking. I did not realize you and the girl fell down so far, Peter Quill. I didn't fall. I jumped. Heroically. Gamora, any chance you can help us here? I got this, Peter. One more time, Groot. Let's go find Corral and Nikki. So, we all agree that the captain and her kid are probably dead, right? Corral survived the worst of the war. And a relationship with Peter. <laughs> Still willing to bet they didn't survive this. You'd wager on whether or not a mother and child are dead. We're not betting on this. Because you know you'd lose. Because it's not appropriate. How's it not appropriate? Because Peter Quill is not emotionally equipped to deal with death. Okay, A, we're all too... Whoa, watch out! You okay? I am Groot. Groot says we should start thinking about exit plans. And the exit plan is to call Cosmo after we get the answers we need. Be careful down there, Peter Quill. Yeah. Definitely a lot sparkier than last time. Uh, make sure the kid ain't floating face up somewhere. Rocket! What? Exhaust all options! Gamora, those pipes look cuttable to you? The pipes aren't the problem. Do something about the electricity and we'll talk. I guess that's good news.
Don't suppose you've seen Nikki. I'm sorry, what? You feeling okay, Peter? It's one of Nikki's robots. She gives them names and takes care of them or whatever. It does not look taken care of to me. It does not strike me as very safe here, Peter Quill. Better this than getting shot at. Eh, speak for yourself. You'd rather get shot at? More fulfilling to shoot someone I don't like than look for someone I don't care about. Our leader seems to care, and so we should also pretend to care. Are you? Uh, of course you would. Careful, Peter Quill. Okay, don't remember this green gas being here last time. I think you mean deadly green gas. This whole ship's a death trap now. I'm sure there's a way to unburst these pipes. There better be, because there's no way I'm walking through that. What about your magical ice weapon, Peter Quill? Or perhaps you enjoy contemplating the intoxicating stench of death. Glorious! There! Breezy peasy! Okay, that was bad, even for you. Ah, more death gas! Maybe Nikki and Corral are using it to protect themselves. Or, and hear me out on this, maybe they're dead. You know what, man? You're being a real jackass, like, way more than usual. Tension is palpable. Oh, can you both please just get over this? Reed, either resolve your issues or fight to the death. Look, Rocket. I know I suck sometimes. We all suck sometimes. Pretty sure it's why we ended up together. I do not. Point is, I care about us. But right now, we're not the ones in danger. And Nikki's just a kid, man. As long as we're clear on the you sucking part. Clear as day. Dog report item. The rumbling continues. Or contracts you. Are you sure this is the right way, Peter Quill? It's clearly not. I'm investigating. Here! This is definitely the right way. These markings suggest otherwise. Exactly. Gamora! Snip, snip! Okay, I'm gonna slice it! You sure this is the right way? Just keep your eyes open. You know, Peter. If Nikki and Corel really are... They're not. I'm just saying we should be ready for anything. They're not. Find a dog report item. No, nothing dog report worthy. Still no signs of Nikki or Corral. 
In the face of death's infinite mystery, Tathians are taught to focus on what is tangible. I'll keep that in mind. Nikki's secret hideout is just through here. Thought we were going to the captain's office. We are, right after we check here. So, any new ideas on what the oversized vacuum's actually doing to Contraxia? A few. None of them good. Try not to break anything. This place means a lot to her. Oh, wow. Didn't Nikki paint all this? Pretty cool, right? Nikki? Little one, reveal yourself. Maybe try being a little less scary. It's Peter. The, the, the pirate? Nikki? We do not intend to kill you. We need to get into that room. Okay, there's a way in behind here. Child, stop playing games. Rocket, you got the body of a little girl. Can you fit in there? Try again, Quill. Ask him nicely, Peter. I'm concerned for Nikki's safety, okay? I'm worried she might be hurt or scared or... I don't know what. Can you please see if she's in there? See? Was that so hard? I don't see no kid. Rumbles more incessantly than a Catathian without breakfast. We really need to get you something to eat. Careful, Peter Quill. In my experience, children often booby-trap their toys. It's not Nikki's, it's mine. So we're just claiming her stuff now? Because if we are... No, I mean it literally used to belong to me. Uh, Quill, you gotta see this. This kid's obsessed with you. Wait, why does she have your toy? It's just something I gave to Corral when we were together during the war, like a keepsake. It doesn't mean anything. Does, uh, this mean anything? How old is the child? Twelve. Ha! Congratulations, Peter Quill. You will make a terrible father. Unless the child is dead, in which case, it does not matter. W wait, is this why you dragged us here? Clearly. The child is twelve. 
And Quill was with the child's mother 12 years ago. The math is irrefutable. Did you know? I just figured you did and didn't want to tell us. His bewildered son. Yes, okay. So the dates maybe kind of match up, so it's possible, I guess. As long as they had a health class on this. Inspiring. Can we just focus on if Corell and Nikki are okay? They're clearly not here, so let's move on and keep looking. Still can't get over how good she is with all this tech stuff. Pretty sure she ain't here, Quill. I think he's still... Staring at it ain't gonna change what it says. It doesn't say anything. Guess Nikki wasn't much of a Skrull fan. Name someone who is a Skrull fan. <laughs> Good point. I'm thinking Nikki won't mind if we use this. What do you say, Rocket? I say I don't care even if she does mind. And voila! Okay, where were we? Congratulating you on being a father. Anyone else feel weird going through Nikki's stuff like this? Peter Quill is her father. It is his duty to pry into her personal life. For all we know, maybe this guy's her dad. Yeesh. Looks like an even bigger deadbeat than you. Looks like Ronan the Accuser to me. Should be a way to Corell's office through those pipes on the left. Yeah, I see an opening. Could be there's a latch on the inside. Allow me, Star Dad. <laughs> I, I get it. <laughs> Guys, did we not make light of all this? We still don't know if they're okay. I am capable of feeling concerned while still laughing at you, Peter Quill. Ditto. I wonder how many other worlds are getting pummeled by one of them things. Got to admit it, Quill. Kid's whole setup is pretty impressive. The way she rigged her terminal to the emergency power grid. I told you, she's a smart kid. Perhaps Peter Quill did not sire this child after all. Yeah, I could see that. She just don't seem dopey enough. Maybe she gets everything from the mother's side. Okay, Drax is clearly on to something, so let's all just go with that. That Nikki is too smart to be your daughter. Whatever it takes to get out of this. You're really gonna be one of those dads? No, that's not what I... I don't know. Point is, none of us know. That's the elevator I took with Corell and Nikki. If we're lucky, maybe they're on their way down right now. When have we ever been lucky? All I know is I am really starting to hate this elevator. General, you newfound patrol energy, Peter Quill. I can't fuck the floor and I'm kicking butt now. Nothing changes. Anyone else nervous about what we're gonna find in Quill's office? No. Well, I have rescued you! Right with the assist! Did the rest of you already know that Peter Quill was the child's father? I definitely suspect it! Blaine Bly is so excited about this mission! Hate to admit it, but I have a really bad feeling about Corell and Nikki! I'm Feelings sure mean nothing! We must see the bodies for ourselves! Everyone okay? Anyone hurt? What? Are you gonna start being all paternal now? We're fine, Peter. We know how to fight. I know. I, I just... We'll find them. Don't worry. You said Corral's office was up top somewhere? Yeah. Just need to make our way up. More deadly gas! Oh, yeah. That's what you expect. You got the emotional maturity of a two-year-old. 
Are you speaking of Peter Quill? Obviously. I'll have you know, I am super emotionally mature. Do you realize you just picked a room full of deadly gas over confronting your fear of fatherhood? I did not! Stop analyzing! Dog report item. There's no dog report item. Next stop, Corel's office. Come on, just admit it, Quill. You're freaking out right now. This whole deadbeat dad thing's gotta be eating at you. None of this changes who I am. I'm still cool as a cucumber. I am Groot. Groot says all the cucumbers he's ever met were terrified on the inside. That don't look good. There was a struggle here. Uh, yeah, that's what I'm reacting to? I am reacting in my own way. This doesn't look good, Peter. All we know is that there was a fight. We don't know who won. Pretty sure I know. So, where's this office, Quill? It's around here somewhere. Place wasn't this messed up last time. When in doubt, follow the stench of death. Ships, fits into small spaces. Don't you dare finish that sentence. And she seems to get along well with Peter. <laughs> Good luck replacing me with a dead kid. takes to find them, longer we can pretend they're okay. Comforting. Shouldn't you be focused on figuring out what's inside those batteries? Quietly? Nah, I tend to think... Hello? Corral? Nikki? Looks empty. Feels empty. Maybe they're hiding. Or there are always strange writings on the wall. I'm gonna try and get in her computer. See if I can wipe my criminal history. Rocket! I'm kidding. I'm gonna access her logs. You wanna know what happened here or not? Fine. The rest of us will take a look around. Maybe they left a clue or something. The scribbles are Cree. This one says, Mother knows best. Any luck getting in? Things pretty well protected. I need time. All right, let me know. Nikki! Obvious signs of a struggle, Peter Quill. Yeah, this doesn't look good. <laughs> Healing. What is this? Some kind of a threat? The Cree Council demands proof of Nikki's heritage under the Cree Purity Laws. What Cree Purity Laws? Corel never told you that either? The Cree are extremely strict about their bloodlines. Uh, this does not look good. For you? No, for Nikki. What are the chances the Cree are involved in any of this? Council of Purity isn't cryptic. When they punish someone, they make sure everyone knows it. Corel and Nikki would be hanging from a wall. Oh, wow! The Kree have comic books? I am surprised. The Kree Council is very strict on approved forms of entertainment. So this could be, like, super valuable then. How valuable are we talking? Nikki's ID. Something seems off, though. What do you mean, off? I don't know. Like it's been flagged or something. Not sure. Just the girl's date of birth on those documents. Does it match with the typical Cree gestation period? I really wouldn't know. Okay, I'm in. But I got bad news, lover boy. What did you find? Come here and I'll show you. So 
what am I looking at? Nothing. She's the captain. Captains keep logs. You keep logs? I I'm trying to tell you, they're gone. All of them. Almost like the world mind went out of its way to sever everything. Have you tried turning it off and on? What about backups? Doesn't every Nova ship have a central hub or something? A Nexus mainframe, yeah. If there's ghosts anywhere in the system, that's where. I categorically refuse. Not literal ghost, Drax. He's talking about data. Right? Yes, but we'd have to access the Nexus directly. Means going to the bridge. We're not leaving until we find out what happened. Center of operations it is. According to the ship's map, the bridge should be right through here. Don't worry, Corel. We'll make sure this gets back to you. Peter, shouldn't we head for the bridge, try to access those logs? Yeah, yeah, I just want to be sure we didn't miss anything. Dog report item. It's one of them priests down there, ain't it? Okay, so... Oh, crap. Uh, nuts to this. I'm out of here. Stop moving. The warrior does not hesitate. not answering. Keep trying. The rest of us can focus on figuring a way out. Really? This is the server room, right? 
And servers mean data? I can't just plug servers into my skull. I still need a central terminal. You said the bridge was on the other side of that corridor. So we just gotta make our way across and then up somehow. How do we get across? Peter's the one with the visor. Unless he broke it. I didn't break it. Perhaps we should have interrogated the robot priest. Yeah, next time we encounter a giant, deadly robot priest, we'll tie him up first and ask questions. Do you have rope? No. Then your plan is untenable. It's weird, right? How the world mind seems to have gone completely dark? Very weird. Perhaps it is rebooting. Of all the words you could have used there, Drax, that one actually wasn't too bad. Thank you. It was either that or reloading. Report item. We have encountered a formidable new enemy, but still no sign of the ghosts. He didn't mean literal ghosts. Ghosts in the system. Remnants of data. Uh, let it go. Just let him think there are ghosts. never understood how so much information can be stored in such a magical way. What, you mean servers? All of it. Servers, computers, technology. So you basically don't understand anything I do? Precisely. to some of these servers. I thought that was the plan. Plan is to get to the bridge and hope that maybe someone left the Nexus unlocked. Wouldn't get my hopes up. Played, Peter Quill. I am Groot. How am I supposed to know why the poops ain't picking up? Keep trying. Okay, so according to the map I saw, Nexus should be just above us. Uh, shall I throw the road at No! Oh, Come on! Man. All right, let's look around. Maybe we can find something.
there. Pretty sure that's our exit. Perfect. So we just gotta jump across a few of these floaty server things? Seems, uh, perfectly safe. They contain near infinite stores of data. Pretty sure they can temporarily support our puny mortal frames. Well, mine anyway. Are you crook? And yours too, yes. So, is this another one of Peter's leaders don't go first situations? To think, all of this could have been avoided had the rodent not broken the glass. You're blaming him for that? Hey Groot, any luck getting through to Cosmo yet? I am Groot. Nope, still nothing. Reception will probably be better once we're on the bridge. Yeah, I don't think that's how it works. Okay, this is it, the command center. Which I guess makes that the next control terminal. Fingers crossed we find something useful. I'm thinking you should do the honors, Quill. That does not seem like you. He probably thinks the next is booby trap. Ah, uh, that would explain it. Hey, I ain't the one that's eager to know what happened. Let Quill see for himself. Locked. I wonder, though. Nikki really didn't want her mom to know about this passkey she gave me. No way is some kid's card gonna bypass the Nexus. Then we're in! You're kidding! Well, yes! Guys, we're in! Get to the juicy stuff already! Channeling your Nova Force. A comprehensive guide to meditation and managing your mental health. Actually, I wouldn't mind a copy of that. Pass. Let me get this straight. She became a teapot? That's what my source said. <laughs> Amazing. I hate you all. Well, that don't sound good. The audio file must be corrupted. The audio file and everything else in the galaxy. Attention, away team. Please ensure your helmet cams are in full operation ahead of this afternoon's away mission into the quarantine zone. Thank you. Just like Corel, everything by the book. Yeah. Attention, away team. Please ensure your... Go to the criminal records, Quill. Uh, we already know your girlfriend works here, Quill. Agent of Thanos. Gamora, care to explain? Not really. Except that it wasn't me. Check it out. Nikki's got a file. Boring. I have heard of this one. AWOL. She crashed into a Leviathan on purpose and is still a better pilot than Quill. <laughs> they can't be that scary if they share a record. What is it with you Humies and your stupid names? I thought there'd be more here. You know, for a non-spacefaring species, us humans sure get around. Hey, isn't that the guy we saw when we tried to pay our fine? Look... Isn't this your friend from the bar? Yep. Grand Unifier Raker. Wonder what he was looking for in the quarantine zone. Wow. Wow. Your record's a lot bigger than I expected. Fun fact! I am unfamiliar with this Kree. One of the nameless. Oh, spooky. Alright, let's take a look. I was wondering how they knew about us. I still do not understand how the Churchman's ship exploded. The Nova Corps is known for their security protocol. Hey, isn't that... The mining ship we explored in the quarantine zone, yeah. When's the footage from? Signal's stronger. We must be close. How close? Hard to say. There's too much interference. After we left, oh, Flark, 
That thing... You don't think. It is the creature that devoured our monster. <laughs> Could have been a million things. I mean, it's restricted space for a reason. I'm Groot. No, you're a Lotus Scud. That thing's got nothing to do with us. Rocket. That gem Corral picked up? I know you recognize it. It's the one you shot. You're saying this is my fault? Ha! That's real rich coming from you, Quill. I'm just saying. We did this. We freed that... shadow thing. Well, there's nothing we can do about it now. Exactly. And the Krill I know is a fighter. Maybe she made it out. Yeah. Krill's tough. If anyone could survive that thing, it's her. I know it. Read our intentions. No, you've made them pretty clear. Sometimes sacrifices must be. I had to check. Groot, write the stars. <gasps> Grand Unifier. Breaker. Right? First, let me just say it's really cool that you've heard of us, right, guys? And it's cool that you didn't try to kill us just then, especially with your two pals right there. You could have totally ripped us apart the moment you walked in, which we obviously all appreciate. But also, we've kind of got a few questions, like... Where are Centurion Corel and her daughter? You came here seeking truth. The Matriarch wishes to share it with you. <laughs> 